Hey, Kathy, this is Tanya. I think this is what you are wanting about uh, running the overdues for the homeroom. If this isn't it, just email me back and um, I'll try again or, or try to stop by. Um, Elaine actually might have already taken care of this, but I wanted to just follow up with you. From here, you would go to reports and then patron reports. So you've been here before, I'm sure. And then um, overdue materials. Oh, wait, no, current checkout and fines. Sorry. Current checkout and fines. And then you have some that you have automatically run. But um, to get the homerooms, um, first of all, uh, you just have your checked out overdue materials. I would just keep it all that's currently overdue in PDF form. And then you press continue. Then from here, uh, just leave everything alone here and press continue. And this is where you can change it. So it's defaulted to patron name, but you can go down and say by homeroom and then choose the teacher. And so you just say if you just want the one A Grimes to A Grimes. Um, if you do more than that, like if you go down from here to here, you need to make sure that you click start a new page for each group or else it'll just be one blob. Um, so let's just do A Grimes to A Grimes. Um, and down here you want to click the home room, then run report, then refresh, and then view. So then up here it will tell you um, for Grimes, here's the name right here, so you remember which one it is, and it has the overdues for that particular teacher. So I hope that helps. Um, if that's not what you were wanting, again, please email me, okay? Have a great rest of the week. Bye.